Hi guys, what's up? Welcome back to my channel. On this channel, we talk about faith, hope, and everything that I love and appreciate. So I'm Jess, and in this video, we're going to be going through like three or four different things that I just think every mom, every dad of like a newborn, new parent, maybe even grandparent would really appreciate while having a newborn. So the first one I'm going to talk about is this Snuggle Me. So I actually got this gifted to me and I just don't know what I would do without it. So I do like to occasionally like co-sleep, I believe you would call it, with my third baby girl. And that's not for everyone, that's what I do though. Um, especially through those long nights of like, I literally feed her and she just won't lay back down just because she wants to snuggle with mommy. Um, anyways, snuggle me. Um, it's just like this giant pillow and it kind of is just like the docketot, but the docketot, so I hear and from what I've seen of prices are just, that's a really expensive version of this bad boy. So snuggle me and basically if you swaddle your kid and you put him in the middle of this, it, I don't know, maybe it like tricks their brain into thinking that like their parent, whoever takes care of them is holding them and they just sleep longer, they're comfortable. It's great for like nap times when you put them like in their crib or something. Um, I feel like in the beginning, I was really anxious about like having this around her when she's sleeping just because, you know, she could like turn her head or whatever and like suffocate. Um, now, I think if you're a parent and you start to learn how your kid um, moves and like, especially when they sleep, like our last daughter, she just kind of slept and her, kept her face like straight, like to the ceiling, if that makes sense. She never really like turned her head at all. So study your kid and stuff and watch how they sleep. And this, this will be like really great. And I think they run about 50 to $80 for the snuggle me. Um, and then they do have covers because I don't know if you can see, it's pretty stained right here just because I'm breastfeeding and when you're breastfeeding and maybe even not because poop is just like messy, it's poop. Um, but if you're breastfeeding, chances are, I believe it's normal for their poop to be like a bright orange, especially in the beginning. It's like a mustardy color and it stains everything almost instantly. And yeah, so... This is used before me, but it wasn't nearly as stained, but now because it doesn't have a cover and I've washed it a whole bunch and it's just still stained, unfortunately. But anyways, this thing is so good and I don't really think that you need to go as expensive as the Doc Dot. That's just my opinion. The next one is this carrier here. Now, I wish I had this with my first two daughters, honestly, because sometimes the baby just doesn't want to be put down, but let's just be honest, if you're a single mom, if you're a mom, period, stay at home mom, stay at home dad, single dad, or even a grandparent, and you're just trying to help out and like babysit your grandkid, they just don't like to be put down sometimes, but you gotta get housework done and like the bare minimum, at least of chores, like dishes and laundry to keep the house like functioning, um, even if that's all you're doing. And so you just wrap up your baby, 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 and, and, and this, and then they just sleep. They literally just sleep. Like I go to a function every week, just about, and just to eat and like hang out with a group of people with me and my kids. And honestly, if I put her in this, she'll just fall right asleep. I don't know if it's like, I think it's the skin to skin just with like the mom or whatever, but it works and they're about $30. They're $30 on Amazon because I put it in my Amazon like uh, registry for my baby shower and somebody bought it and they come in many different colors. I got this color just because it's like, it's not pink because obviously I have all girls but pink doesn't go with every outfit and I don't wanna just be like, I'm a girl mom all the time because I like to wear other colors besides pink. So, it's not pink, but it's not blue, it's purple. Anyways, go get it, you won't regret it. And you can use it anywhere, even in the house, like I said, to get some chores done. Okay, 
The next one is this Mustella Emollient Cream with Sunflower Oil, I believe. I do believe this is from Italy or something like that, um, European of that nature because on the back it literally has like a different language. Um, but this stuff guys is so good. So it's an in-between mixture of Vaseline and baby lotion. And so like I already put some like on my hands but I'll do it again. And it's, it's just so great. It's so great because Vaseline is too thick, right? Put this on. I'll show you guys. And you only need like a little bit because it goes literally on and just like moisturizes the skin so well. And then, so basically, it makes your skin so freaking supple. I got that from a store kind of like TJ Maxx where they buy like wholesale. I can't remember what store I got it from. But you know the ones where they buy wholesale and then they sell it for cheaper it was kind of like that so i have no idea what the actual price that it will be but i'm running out so i think i paid 3.99 so we'll see maybe i'll just go on amazon or something the next one is these nano babies um so i did not pay full price for these either i went to saint vinnie's here in my hometown and they're just so freaking cool so they are shaped like a boob, which is great because like, I don't know if babies are that smart or if it really matters, but it makes sense if like the dad or like the grandparents are like watching the baby while like the mom works and the baby's just used to like holding like the mom's boob or something, um, or just like having like the boob like near them. So they like recognize like a familiar shape. I don't know. I don't know. I'm not a baby, so I don't know. Anyways, they come with these little nipples, and then you can just take off this and pour milk into it. This is what I use them for. I go to work, and I need to pump while I'm at work. So the cool thing is, they not only come with the nipple part, they come with these things where you put your express milk in there, and you screw these on top, and it literally does not come out. It will not come out. And I usually take two of them, and they'll stack right on top of each other, throw them in my purse, doesn't leak at all. And then when you get home, you just put it in the fridge or you put it in those freezer breast milk bags and you freeze it. And it's so great. And so like the bottom part, if I can get it, because my hands are, are all slimy now. Anyways, the bottom part comes apart and you just pop it back on. Literally, you have to make sure it's on there. But usually if you just press it up against like the counter or like in between your hands, um, it's kind of like a weird suction cup, um, thing going on here and they work so great. And then you can stack them. I think they come like four, four to a five pack. And then you can just stack them in your fridge instead of like all of these bottles around. And the cool thing too, is when you take it out and say you want to put it in a freezer bag, um, if you just take them out and you put them like this in a bottle or one of the bags, it will spill. But they come with this, and now you can, like, pour it. And I'm just, like, I think I paid, like, $5 for the box that it came in off of Amazon at St. Vinny's. And I'm just so grateful. I don't use the bottle form just because I think it comes out too fast for her, and she just doesn't do well with it. We actually use the Dr. Browns or something like that with the, with the green thing in it, so, like, the... The flow doesn't make her spit up, even though she spits up quite a bit. Um, anyways, yeah, I really, really freaking love these. And they're like $20 for the pack of them. Plus you get that like the cleaner brush and like the wire, I believe, on Amazon. Like how freaking cool is that? Anyways, I think that's it. I literally think that's it. At least for this video, because I do have other things like gripe water, um, a teething necklace, we haven't tried that on this one yet. And a couple of other things like her pack and play, I fell in love with it because they have so many cool parts. So stay tuned for those videos and a couple of others relating to having a newborn. And I hope this really helps you guys out. It really helped me out a lot, um, helped her dad out a lot and just making like the function of the family, like keep going because you need that during newborn stage. And if you're in that right now, I feel it just keep going. It's kind of like you go in robot mode, unfortunately, 
because with emotions and hormones and whatever, like the baby literally takes the lead. It's like a dance, but a fresh new baby who doesn't know anything about the world is taking the lead. And it's just, you're along for the ride. But it's a beautiful thing because you're gonna look back and be like, oh, I miss those days. And I literally think this is my last kid that I will give birth to. And I'm just trying to soak in every ounce of like time and like moment with her. And I feel like I'm doing a good job about that, but the time is going by like so fast already. Like she was like nine pounds and she's already probably 14 pushing 15 pounds. Like she's a chunker right now. And I'm like, how? Like you weren't small, but like you're so much bigger. And my oldest is about to be 10. And I'm like, that's going to be you. And like, I feel like a couple months. Anyways, I love you guys and I'll see you in the next one. Thanks for watching.